How's it going, everybody? Hope everyone's doing well. Hope everyone's having a great weekend. Oh. Hey everybody, hope everyone's doing well. It's a kind of a crappy weekend over here this Saturday afternoon. And in this video, I'm going to put my Speedos on and my bathing cap, and I'm going to jump into a small pond of alligators. Now, wouldn't that make for a great video? Nope, today is a, another unboxing. All right, so what we have in this box is, I don't know, let's open it. Actually, I do know, but you don't. We have paper, paper. And more paper. And more paper. And more paper. A few moments later. Two hours later. One eternity later. More paper. More paper. More paper. Oh, I wonder what that is. Hmm. Well, let me get rid of all this paper. Well, I have to say, they did a very well packing job on this. So let's get into what I've got. Let's find a zipper. All right, so playing around on eBay and figured this was going to a good cause. There was a bid going on for a Goodwill and I found something got it at a decent price and put a bid on it and won it so what it is it Ibanez a little bit dirty a little bit dusty uh, this one is made in Korea it's pretty nice still has the plastic over the back covers very thin now, I do not know if I has got the whammy bar for it or not but uh, I do have extra whammy bars so I'm not too concerned about that this thing is kind of dirty but in very 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 good shape very good shape this is an S series Ivan S the only thing I don't know is I do have a serial number here but I do not have a model on this guitar so I'm gonna have to do a little bit of research and find out a little bit more information so yeah, here she is. And like I said, thin line, very thin, very light. This guitar has no weight to it at all. And it has a little squirrely in the, uh, what do you call it, the uh, inlays. It, the only thing that's missing is the locks for the nut. And I already have those. So I've got plenty of those things. So otherwise, I'm gonna check this thing out. It's probably not in tune. I can tell by the way that the bridge is setting that this is not set up properly as far as where it's supposed to be. It should be a little bit higher. The bridge is supposed to be even with the body of the guitar and it is not. So it looks like it's been very, very well played and uh, yeah. So this might be something I might upgrade the pickups on. I might do a little, little bit with it here and there. Not too sure. But I am going to check out everything. You know, like I said, it's got some pretty fuzzy fucking shit all over it that's for sure and a lot of dust as you can tell by the headstock you can probably see the dust in the headstock basic Ivan has tuners nothing really fancy with those um, frets feel very very well there is like shit no fret wear on this thing at all 
So I figured, you know what, it was going to a good cause, so I grabbed it. So there you have it, another unboxing. Go figure, right? Haven't been doing too much on my channel. Uh, I've been kind of practicing a little bit with a song that I've been working on. This is going to be an actual true cover, not necessarily a play along. And I just want to get things kind of not really right because it is going to be a cover. So some things are going to be a little bit different than the original. But I am working on it and I will be posting a video of that hopefully soon within like maybe a couple weeks or so. So stick with me and uh, thanks for watching, thanks for subbing and take it easy everyone. Alright so getting rid of the box and bumping the box around I kind of heard a little bit of a jingling inside of it so I ended up flipping the box over cutting the bottom half open up found a little bit of a goodie bag inside there got the Allen keys for this guitar I also got the locks for the nut which is kind of nice I don't have to go and use the spares that I have of my own also inside this bag was two wrenches which look like they're maybe 10 millimeters not too sure you know probably use them for you know tightening up your uh, the nuts for the controls or possibly yeah, tightening up the keys for your tuners or not the keys but you know what I mean kind of look like something you would find that would come with a small Dremel or you know little router or something like that but anyways kind of cool didn't get the whammy bar but I've got plenty of those so I'm not worried about it anyways back to the outro <laughs>